send a file to all. Let's have a look at how we do this in Teams, Zoom and Google Meet. In Teams, the quickest way to share a file with your class is to drop it into a chat. Click on Show Conversation, get your file, drop it into where it says Drop Your Files here. If this comes up, just click on Replace, wait for it to load, and then click on Send. And that's it, your file has been sent to your class. In Zoom, it's really similar. So you can head over into the chat and send a file in here as well. And this will go straight to all of the people that are in your chat. So let's take this Can You Decrypt It file, pop it in here, that's it. I've now shared that with anyone else that's in this Zoom meeting. In Google Meet, it's not quite as straightforward to share a file. So what you first of all have to do is put the file in somewhere that you can access online. So I've already stuck my file into my Estelle share drive, which is one of the folders on my Google Drive. And what I'm gonna share is this file here, which is a PDF file. So what I need to do for that is I'm just gonna open it up. This is the file I'm gonna be sharing. I'm gonna click on the three dots and go to share. It will give me a link which I'm going to copy and I'm going to copy that link and paste that into the chat. So I'm going to click on the chat icon again and I'm going to paste that in here and that will then provide a link for everyone to access that file. Make sure you set the permissions correctly so that people can't edit the file, that they can only view it, that way they can view and download, but they can't make any changes to the file, because if you make changes to it, obviously those changes will be applicable for everyone that accesses the file. Um, so this works for any of the online sharing cloud-based services. So if you've got something like Dropbox, you could share links to Dropbox, or you could share them uh, links to OneDrive as well.